If you like our video today, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and subscribe. Cheers. Top of the world, or top of Mount Oberon anyway. Melbourne to Wilson's Promontory is over 220 kilometres in distance. We are passing through a couple of towns, the biggest town being of Leon Gatha. Remember we stopped at the McDonald's a long time ago? Ah yes. It's just two years ago. Where's the names of them? Now we collect our keys. Aha! Okay. We stayed at Prom Hills Cabins in a little town called Yanniki. It is only 10 kilometers away from Wilson's Prom National Park entrance. Well, I like it. Our cabin had fantastic views. It was very clean and secure, and it was at a reasonably good price too. Stop. To collect visitor guides. Okay, time's a close. <laughs> what is it? Well, this is. Uh, this is well, just grab the map. Oh, just grab a map. Oh, we are down at uh, Wilson's Promontory. Be views are sensational. It covers a vast amount of land and um, yeah, it's beautiful down here. Sensational. Wilson's Prom has been a national park since 1898. Wow. remaining patches of natural bush in Australia. It's the southernmost point of Australian mainland. There are numerous walking tracks to discover. 
We chose Pillar Point, a relatively easy 1.8 kilometer track. Millions of years here, right? Yeah, I think so. Probably. I'm just not sure that it looks old. Dennis checking when the sunset is today. <laughs> In Wilson. From so when is it? From Wilson's from. The elevation is not big, but I feel already tired. Each time we come to Wilson's prom, we enjoy the views and scenery. Pillar Point is a bunch of granite boulders with breathtaking views of Norman, squeaky beaches and the islands. We saw lots of wallabies, but unfortunately we didn't see many other types of animals. Hello. Hello. Hey guys, just coming in for the day. Yeah, just for the day. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. Thanks a lot. Through. Thank you. Yeah. See ya. <laughs> That's it. Oh, it's a diff it looks different today. It's no, a different it's, one. It's a different one. We decided to have a penny code cruise and we certainly didn't regret our decision as we enjoyed every single moment. Um, look, uh, with COVID, we do all have to be wearing masks at all times on board, okay? Um, so please make sure you've got a mask. If you haven't got one, we can provide one. They do have to be worn on your face, not just under your chin, like most people seem to wear them, okay? You're right there, Victoria. Oh, yeah, they are. Thank you. From what we heard, 25% of ticket sales goes to nature conservation. We travelled in a very special boat, a custom built three wheel amphibious speedboat. It was very comfortable and it was also very safe. sea eagle we've got a few of them around here and um, they're actually the second largest eagle in Australia we have the marine national park over there at the prom there's about 50,000 hectares of national park over at the prom so all the land you can see over there yeah, so we have a pied cormorant as well and black cormorants and they're a lot bigger than these guys they can dive down to 200 meters deep holding their breath for about seven minutes what seven minutes Season now, and it's time to give birth, so you'll find the season on the rocks. 384 million years 
old just like that granite and uh, it's about 113 meters high that cavern is 60 meters deep 60 meters high and 130 meters wide so um, you can actually almost fit the sails of the sydney opera house inside that fantastic cruise did you like it then? it was sensational it was fantastic well recommended just that's for sure cruise. absolutely <laughs> Amazing. So this is the only shop here? Yes. Okay. It's open. I'm sorry. <laughs> we decided to have lunch before our next adventure at Mount Oberon Summit. We dropped in in the only general store in Wilson's Promontory Park. Happy? Yeah, it would be even better salad. I'll show you. I said to just turn it back a bit, yeah. Coming yeah, I know. Just come to say hello. <laughs> Fish and chips. Mm -hmm. Fish and chips. Uh, mm -hmm. And we have tata sauce. Mm -hmm. It's part of the deal? Yeah, it's part of the deal. Yeah. And, and salad. And salad, part of the deal as well. And mm. how much does it cost? 20? 20... 21.95. 22 bucks. Yeah, 22 bucks. Plus... Oh, we got the drinks all up was $30. It's, yeah, plus drinks, yeah. which are 30 bucks. 30 bucks. 29 nice. 95 so. It's nice. No, it's pretty good. We hopped on the free shuttle bus to Mount Oberon. We are starting to climb Mount Oberon Summit. One hour. This one? I don't know. One hour. I don't know. 3.4 kilometers. Yeah. Yep. Damn. Mount Oberon Summit Height is the most popular track in Wilson's Prom. It's a steady uphill climb. Not too strenuous to the natural viewing platform. Mount Oberon has an elevation of 558 metres. The views are sensational. Over and anyway. Good. Beautiful view. Yeah. Daniel is eating our dinner. Good and you then. I'm having a hamburger. Hamburger? The hamburger. Okay. Mm. Well cooked hamburger. Mm. Hello, how are you? Just for the day, yeah. yeah. Would you like any maps or anything? Um, no, we got them, thanks. No worries. Thank you. Good. Thank, Thank you. you. Sarah. Oh, gee, Victor, why are you to do that? Doing the Prom Wildlife Walk today. 2.3 kilometres. Nice, easy walk. And hopefully we can see some wombats and wallabies. Wallabies, but wombats. Well, I've seen wombats, but Victoria hasn't, so. Okay, let's it's, go. I aim to see wombats. Yeah, let's go.
Вот лоцу голуби из лука. Lots of wallabies. But the aim today is to see a wombat. If we see a wombat, it'll be all good. This is our last track to Cottage Beach. Only a short walk. The beach was beautiful, but the sand flies were terrible. We love Wilson's Promontory and we'll be definitely going back there again.